just been in you ca I hope I got some good footage in there but my camera doesn't really cope in low light but it's um, one of the ruin bars one of the seven I think it is I can't remember if it's seven or nine ruin that one's bars the most famous, yeah. yeah that one's the most famous that one's called Simplicate I'll put the um, name of it on screen and it's basically just like these old ruins that have been turned into little um, bars and literally it was amazing like every single different room that you went in it felt like you were walking into a different club a uh, different bar sorry but it was all un under the same roof so weird if you're ever in budapest you have to visit it it's like incredible it kind of reminded me of camden because it was so like random and quirky we're gonna go find another one now <laughs> hopefully because apparently they're all pretty close to one another. It's a little time of year. I'm not sure if they're all going to be open because a lot of them are primarily outside where Simply Curl is quite indoors. Yeah. Even though it's built in like an outside space, they've like put loads of barriers in it. Yeah. It was actually quite warm, wasn't it? It was quite warm. We got to take our gloves off. So that's a sign that it's warm. But yeah, hopefully we'll find another one. If not, we'll contact Google Maps. Went into another one of the room bars. This one's called Dobros? Dobros. Dobos. Dobos. D O B O Z. And um, as you could see, it wasn't even open yet. It was like a ghost town. But it looked really cool. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? That's a really bright light. Very bright. <laughs> like this lighting on my face right now is just from a sign. <laughs> well, it looked cool, but it wasn't open. <laughs> <laughs> We're early birds. <laughs> Ow, that is bright. It suddenly oh. did. Oh my god, look how bright it is. <laughs> Seriously. It's, um, how, what time is it? 7 20. 24 7. Hey guys, so we are, we've just got back to the hotel. We've decided to come back because we did want to book a table at the hotel's restaurant, but it's fully booked for tonight. Um, so we're just going to order room service instead because it's just easier than looking for a, ho uh, a hotel, looking for another restaurant. Also, I think I forgot to tell you guys earlier in the vlog that we actually got upgraded for free. So the room we're in, we got upgraded because it's our anniversary. Although they must think we're married because they left us like a little card with the desserts that you would have seen on the first day saying like, um to mr and mrs happy anniversary or something like that and the last clip you would have seen we went to 
a bar called what was it called i can't remember what it was called but i'm sure it would have been on the screen and um, when we went there and that was really good they played some pretty good music and we had a gin and tonic there um and we had one at simpler cut as well so the plan is have some food maybe watch a movie have a bath and yeah then just chill really um so tomorrow is sunday our last like full day here and i think tomorrow we're gonna go to the thermal baths um and have a look around there what else did we say we wanted to do um, i can't remember wanting to go to the market but we can't oh it's yeah closed. Yeah, there's like a food market that we wanted to go to, but it's closed on Sundays. So we might go there on Monday because we've got like a flight in the afternoon. By the way, guys, I have got a bodysuit on, although it looks like I'm just sat here in my bra. <laughs> um, but yeah, we might go there on Sunday. No, nope, Monday. I'm tired. I love Budapest so far. It's a really nice city, isn't it? Yeah, it's extremely friendly. Like Everyone's really nice. Yeah. Like, to the point where like, everyone lets you cross the road like all the cars just stop just let you cross the road yeah there's like no litter anywhere it's it's really clean it's lovely yeah it's a really clean city um we've seen quite a few homeless people as well um we've given them like some change yeah, um, there's nothing else you can actually do with the change in hungary right yeah <laughs> yeah like... hungarian um currency is so weird it's a beautiful place so far it's just so cold like the minute you step outside, you're cold. Also, have two donuts left from that donut place we went to earlier oh, today. Yeah, that's dessert. Yeah, that's gonna be our dessert. After our cottage cheese, don't <laughs> Yeah, so I will show you guys our room service food. We've ordered two um, sirloin steaks, which we actually ordered room service last night, and I had a Caesar salad with chicken, and Alan had the steak, and. The steak looked so good, so I'll show you once it arrives. And then we've ordered the dessert of the day, which apparently is cottage cheese. Dumplings. Which don't actually look that bad. But the, the idea of cottage cheese dumplings, yeah, like, look, look, it sounds like so, a starter. If somebody showed you that, you wouldn't think that was cottage cheese. That's apparently the dessert we're having. But it looks like cake. I mean, I like cheesecake, so... Yeah. Over that. <laughs> Let's hope it's nice. Today I've been saying the most stupid things. <laughs> so I called, so I put an anniversary card for Alan this morning near the coffee machine that we've got in the room and I called it a card machine. Do you think it is sleep deprivation? But... What was the other stupid thing that I said? Um, yeah, when well you said, uh, oh, the lift's got six floors. I wonder how many floors it has. Yeah. <laughs> oh, honestly, I didn't sleep too great last night. I don't know why. Um, but yeah, <laughs> hopefully tonight will be a better night. So the next clip you'll see is, um, our room service food. Ta-da! And... Cottage cheese dumplings. Thermal baths, Saichini uh, baths. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. We just got into our little cabin and we're just going to get changed. Um, I don't think I'm going to be able to film out there because I don't want to get my camera wet or anything. But, but yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. Yeah, it's really good. This is a very small little room, by the way. Yeah, it's very cozy in here. So it's definitely worth it to get changed and we can leave our stuff in here. So I'll catch up with you guys afterwards. It's snowing. It is full on snowing. It's actually setting as well. Oh, <laughs> I just caught that on camera. Right, you walk. No, duck. 
but I'm gonna hold on this time. So, we're in the St. Stephen's Basilica. We've just paid 1,000 Hungarian forints each to climb up 300, how many? 302 stairs. I'm all, it doesn't sound like a lot, but they're spiral stairs. What? No way. That was not 302 steps. Oh. <laughs> Um, we've just had some lunch at the um, <laughs> at the burger place that we went to on Friday. Oh, I can't finish those burgers. They're so big, honestly. They are. I'm out of breath. I'll show you what it looks like in a second. <laughs> oh, there's more stairs. <laughs> yeah. This is the inside dome, and, that's the and then this is the outside dome. I want to go up there. <laughs> More stairs. Okay, we've made it. And, oh, it's really bright out here. <coughs> okay, it was definitely worth it, walk, wasn't it? I'll show you guys the view. So, focus, this is the church, Fisherman's Basilica, Fisherman's Bastion, Bastion, this is the Basilica, <laughs> it needs a clean though, it's all very green, there is the square, oh my god, that makes me really nervous, oh my god, look, <laughs> of a drop. Hope you've done this up tight. That would have been a lot of footage just lost. are just at Hero Square which is a little plaza sort of area that um, honours all of the heroes from the war I believe I don't know if I'm right or wrong so we're just gonna take a couple of pictures here so we're near where we were this morning when we went to the thermal baths but we didn't come here earlier because we wanted to go back to the hotel and get dry and change etc um, so yeah so we're gonna take a couple of shots and have a little walk around here. I think there's an ice rink around here somewhere. So we'll, um, oh God. <laughs> we're gonna go there. Alan's got his camera out again, taking some shots of this taxi.
walked all the way from Hero Square area back to the hotel. We've just been to that donut shop that we went to the other day and we've bought six donuts. We want to take some back to England with us. Um, so I'll just show you those before they get demolished. There's two pistachio, salted caramel, Oreo, Kinder Bueno, strawberry apple. If you guys are ever, oh, my camera battery's flashing. There we go, just swapped my camera battery. Um, we also stopped at a souvenir shop and we got ourselves a little magnet. So this is the one that I got. A tradition of ours, every like holiday that we go on our city break, we always get ourselves a little magnet of where we go to stick to our fridge. <laughs> Alan's just sat eating donuts. We're actually going to go out and find somewhere to eat a traditional dish here from Budapest or Hungary called goulash. Um, it's like five o'clock at the minute, so we're just going to find somewhere to eat that and then have like proper dinner a bit later on. But it's our last night here. We fly out tomorrow morning. My lips are so dry. Is that nice? Mm -hmm. This sofa is just a comfy Honestly, right, this sofa behind me, every time Alan sits on it, he's <laughs> like, sleep mode. <laughs> we need one of these. <laughs> Look at him. He's sat over there. He's gonna fall asleep. <laughs> Look no, no. I am gonna miss this place though. Like, oh yeah. Also, look at that. That's from last night's room service, and it's not been taken away. But yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna miss this place. <laughs>